Yeah, there they are. Those are ours. Whoa, he's got his food and he's running. Yeah. Run away. <laughs> see, see. Yeah. <laughs> Run away. Don't pick, don't pick one. Wouldn't it? Yeah, four stay there. Yeah. <laughs> Just look. Oh, there's a lot. Definitely beautiful sunset. Overlooking the land there. I was actually hit by an explosive <laughs> on my drive here, believe it or not. Uh, somebody had looked like they were lighting some grass on fire on the, on the side of the road. And it uh, turned out it wasn't grass they were lighting on fire. It was some sort of uh, rocket or explosive or, or whatever it was. I don't know. Supposedly intended to scare away birds and stuff like that. But uh, it exploded right as I drove by. And... Uh, at least a portion of it hit me in the arm and in the in the side or in the stomach, I guess. Left kind of a, a bit of a bump and uh, definitely a red mark. Hurt like hell too. No, no blood or anything, but I'll have to be aware of that in the future going forward. If you see anybody on the side of the road lighting something on fire, do not go anywhere near them. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna sound probably a little stupid here to some people because I had no clue that coconut trees actually grew like straight out of the coconut. I thought that there was some kind of smaller seed or something like that that uh, you know they came out of, but the, the entire coconut turns into the coconut tree. <laughs> I guess that's, uh, you know, stupid Saskatchewan boy, not knowing what he's uh, talking about. You okay? <laughs> See you. Bye bye. Bye bye. Careful, careful. Bye. And off she goes. <laughs> Not sure how well you can see that, but there are a ton of bats big ones in this tree. Actually, quite a few trees along here. There's huge bats. I don't even know if they're bats really flying foxes with the... When did they become a fox? I don't know. <laughs> Where? <laughs> it's a lot of happy goats, man. <laughs> Many happy goats. Schwacker cows out today. Got a big cow traffic jam. So it should be finished today. I think uh, they're just maybe have, oh, I don't know, 50 trips left or something like that. And uh, that'll be it for the land raising. This is a nice contrast to uh, Canada too. Like if you were sitting outside in the summertime or, you know, anytime it'd be pleasant to sit outside, you'd be like surrounded by a cloud of bugs around a, a, a light like that. Whereas here, you know, there, there's, you know, one or two, but there's just not that many bugs really. And I haven't been getting bit by mosquitoes at all. So it's, uh, it 
it's uh, it's a pretty nice feature.